Hello everyone, welcome to another fantasy match preview. This is for the game between England and Sri Lanka. It's all to play for for England because it's all or nothing. If they win, they go through. If they don't win, then Australia go through. So expect a long call between Vanindu Asranga and Glenn Maxwell tonight to relive some sweet RCB memories and maybe a BBL contract too. And we have Nikhil Bhai with us today to carry you through this preview and tell you who's going to win this game. Bilkul, thanks as always for having me. Uh, thankfully, two good games. Uh, the best teams worked in both of them. As we have talked about now, form se masti nahi karo to form aapka sath de rahi hai to hopefully hmm. we can continue that england sri lanka at sydney aap traditionally socha ke to sri lanka slight favorite hmm. only because the ball is holding a bit uh, in the in the surfaces at times but hmm. again sydney's probably seen the most number of highest scores i think in this tournament so far and england would love that so that is it's going to be a very enticing battle between sri hmm. lanka's spin and england's batters जो भी एक कांटेस्ट जीतता है बिल्कुल नहीं है राइट एंड इन फैक्ट लास्ट ईयर आल्सो वी हैड अ सिमिलर इंप्रेशन दैट अट शारजा श्रीलंका माइट बी द हैव द नोज अहेड बट देन बटलर जस्ट शोड सम रेजिलियंस एंड प्लेड एन अमेजिंग नॉक एंड नाउ दैट इट्स अ नॉकआउट वी कैन ओनली एक्सपेक्ट बेटर सो इट शुड बी अ गुड गेम एंड लेट्स लुक एट वेन्यू कंडीशंस फर्स्ट अप So the game is going to be played at the SCG, and typically till now no one has won chasing here. Till now it's all been batting first, and you might say that weather and other things have intervened in the middle. But it seems like weather should be clear. And while it's not really turned typically, it has been slow and has had some sort of grip. It's not been a square turner, but it surely has something in it for spin. And it's not the place where you'll want to cut. your spinners overs and both these teams have not only full time but some part time spin options too so will be very interesting to see bilkul i think whichever teams bats first and gets a good score i personally feel they'll be a lot more confident because we've also seen mm. the ball move a bit on the lights right through mm. australia uh, but again the uh, key thing to remember is this game is very condition dependent not just like this game apne pakistan south africa ka game dekha Which was used, the ball was not coming onto the bat. They started to play under uh, during the rain. Pitch को जो अच्छा चीज चाहिए था to get together. That happened during the rain. The pitch got better to bat on. So hmm. that is the thing that we keep seeing with uh, you know game that the conditions can change very quickly. So traditionally, जैसे हमने बात करी है, bat first, put on a big score, get your new ball bowlers in, and then hold the spinners to really you know not just take plenty of wickets, but the pressure hmm. keeps rising. तो ऐसा मत करना कि एक ही साइड की बॉलिंग आप पैक कर दो ट्राई एंड कवर बोथ एंगल्स एंड यस अनदर गुड गेम फॉर स्मॉली इफ यू गेट द राइट विजुलाइजेशन इन टर्म्स ऑफ इफ यू आर कॉन्फिडेंट अबाउट इट and typically we have also seen early wickets in the second innings at sydney we have seen that in the second innings there have been some wickets under light so will be interesting to see whether that happens again or not for pace and before we get to the base team we have to announce our jersey giveaway winner for yesterday's game this was the closest answer maxwell hit 54 runs the closest answer was 55 runs and the earliest from kushal there was also another answer right before the game began of 53 but as the gap is only one on each side he is the deserving winner as he answered first and yes there was also a notorious comment right after the first innings ended of 54 runs so yes uh, that cannot be announced as winner so yes this is a winner kushal please do dm us on twitter with your address and contact details and congrats to you yes very get great call there uh, maxwell just came through for australia and i think it was not more than maxwell said afghanistan to help kari thoda ek to hit aur laga lete to the game could have been historic Yes, was a cracking game, and it's been a cracking leaderboard too. It's been building up very well, and now that very few games are left, please ensure that you take full advantage and you make multiple combinations because this is the last set of league games. So don't miss out. And the better you do here, the more teams you make here will also benefit you automatically in the investment leaderboard. बिल्कुल जैसे हमने बार-बार कहा है क्योंकि हमारी base teams चल रही हैं. तो आपको सिर्फ यही करना है कि बेस टीम पे अपनी गटफी लगानी है रोटेट करना है कैप्टन वाइस कैप्टन 
आप सभी लीडर बोर्ड में आकर रहोगे बीट योर गेम लीडर बोर्ड और योर टूर्नामेंट लीडर बोर्ड तो बेनिफिट सेम ऐसे और अगेन अनदर डे ग्रेट गेम टू ट्राई सेकेंड इन फैंटेसी बिकॉज यू नो हाउ कंडीशन आर शेपिंग अप तो इट इज जस्ट बेस्ट क्योंकि आप सेकेंड इज में जैसे आज अफगानिस्तान वाले गेम में भी you could have easily still take a rashid khan over couple of afghanistan's top order batters so that mm-hmm. is the smartness that you can show uh, in technics fantasy so wahan pe bhi aapko reward hai aur kyunki aap investment karoge to use karo usko sabhi jagah pe aur investment investment mein bhi aapke paas leader board hai to get better at <laughs> yes absolutely so if you've not downloaded the fan to play app yet link is in the description do it right now too many benefits lined up for you jersey giveaway at the end of the video but first up let's look at the base team So let's look at what the setup for this amazing game is going to be England versus Sri Lanka we have set up right now with two keepers and two batters now reason for backing Kusal Mendes is th- he has nothing to lose Sri Lanka might either come very hard or come totally flat out but we are expecting them to come very hard in this game and keep in mind that Chris Wokes ha- did get some wickets in the last game but he's not looked in the best sort of form with the ball he's not been getting much movement and he does not have the pace to trouble these openers typically the other two openers are pretty obvious in butler and hills it will be interesting to see how hills tackles tikshana bilkul jaise dekho dono bhi options kafi obvious hain both kusal and jos again jos will make a very good captain vice captain option for many he also saw what he did last year and now that hills is also got a few runs maybe jos will be able to take that much bit time to really go after his kind of bowling kyunki yahan pe ek bahut bada match up hai with mahindra asranga i don't think anybody else apart from jos will he, will be able to read him well apart from liam livingston to un dono ke match up bhi better hai against mahindra baaki sab ke itne theek hai so that it becomes a very important match up for sri lanka dekhe agar jos jaldi chala jata hai to then mahindra is in the game big time so that's a very important thing kusal mendes ko trouble kara hai left arm ne bhi so hmm. uh, england do have uh, an option there and high pace also troubles kusal so with both kusal and uh, patu misan ka mera ek hi concern hai that is mark wood so ab england unhe kaise use karti hai that i think will decide how uh, sri lanka stop order batch yes and the key concern for us with picking other sri lankan batters is they've been very sporadic on some days they turn up other days they don't these guys have seemed to be batting little more stably and kusal can give you points with the gloves too and hence we have opted for him in the all rounders we have gone with dds one indo and sam as captain and vice captain respectively and liam livingston is fourth choice we obviously have stokes which we will discuss later but the problem with stokes is that he's playing one shot too many which becomes difficult for you to accommodate especially when we know that the op- opposing team has three spinners and it's not going to be easy to do that against them and in the bowling also he's been bowling one or two odd overs here and that's not been the full set bilkul dekh ke sabne pehle bhi discuss kara hai with strokes they've tried to fit him wherever they can uh, so now it's completely your call that whether you feel ke bada din hai bada play step up karega please hmm. go ahead and take it aapko fantasy player mein option milta hai ki aap ek hi keeper ke sath jao take the fifth all rounder make the most of it to please go ahead and do that i think he will be a very common grounding option for everybody to try out unke alawa jaise humne kaha dono inning mein wickets gir rahi hai isliye vanindu aur sam captain vice captain hai kyunki vanindu se bhi aap expect karte ho pichle game mein last over aa raha tha hmm i don't think wo har baar hoga but that is the reliability that you have with vanindu ke atlas wo char over darling that is not the case with lehru kumara or sometimes hmm. even uh, the other paces that they have and the same is the case with sam karan he is that designated hmm. end overs bowler तो अगर सेकंड इनिंग्स में भी गेम डीप जाती है सैम कुड इजीली टेक डू अ जस्ट लिटिल फॉर फॉर अस टेक थ्री विकेट्स इन एन ओवर एंड जस्ट ओपन द गेम फॉर हिज साइड तो दैट इज द लॉजिक देयर यस एब्सोल्युटली सो वी हैव ट्राइड टू कवर की बोलिंग ऑप्शंस फ्रॉम बोथ टीम्स एंड नाउ लेट्स सी व्हाट की ग्रैंड लीग ऑप्शंस वी हैव फॉर दिस गेम So, sir, tell us your two grand league options for this game. Whew, quite a tough one. That I think it's going to be proper grand league option only. Uh, with England, I'll still stick with David Malan. Hmm. Uh, I think on good batting decks, David Malan does come off very well. 
but hmm. the biggest caveat to that is his entry point if hales and jos butler start well malan doesn't get to bat at all like it happened in the, in the previous game but if he gets to bat i think he's going to be able to pull up a very good score simply the conditions be he should enjoy thoda uh, unko threat rahega jo spin ke options hai but i think he's quality enough to see them through so again proper quality hmm. option there uh, from sri lanka my grand league option is again another left hander uh, very rare ki main do batters ke sath ja raha hu but acharya uh, asalanka been quite a while i think australia is where asalanka got into his own and hmm. uh, as we said there is literally nothing to lose for sri lanka so if they come out and play freely uh, he can really lift the uh, the night up for sri lanka and their fans and for australia also I I totally agree with that Asalanka pick, and you might see that Q taken in in my team also tomorrow with Malan. I don't know with the spin. I'm I'm always yeah. suspect with him, but uh, because he's taken two left-handers, let's continue the yeah. left-hand syndrome. I'm backing. I backed Moin Ali last time, and I think he did decently. It just didn't come off in the points because yeah. he had to bat in a very rash way. But I feel like he'll get that chance again tomorrow. and he plays spin well and tomorrow is going to be spin spin all the way so moin ali and he can also bowl against banuka and charit in the middle order and uh, from sri lanka i'm going with banuka rajapaksa short square boundaries and uh, a leg spinner in front of him so i think he should be able to capitalize so yes it should be interesting on how that goes Yes, we could eventually cancel each other's picks also, but yeah, that's yeah. how grand it is. <laughs> yeah, so it's I, it's either one of them. Probably, if I'm taking Banuka, it might not be Moin or the other way around. Unless yeah. I feel like both of them are going to score big. In that case, yeah. we can go with both. But yes, that is what the setup for us for tomorrow's games are. So please try and make multiple combinations. And now we have the golden question for today of the jersey giveaway. and the question is very simple just predict who will be the lowest pointer from england tomorrow whoever is the lowest pointer on the fan to play app from england tomorrow you just need to predict player name so player name david malan and number of points <laughs> david malan is only an example and number of points in the comments fastest first wins no multiple no edited comments i'll not say anything i'll not say anything <laughs> Thank you so much to everyone who tuned in. Second last day of the Super 12, so make sure you take full advantage in all the leaderboards and join as many leagues as you can, so you're able to capitalize. And we'll see you all on the last day of the Super 12. Thank you so much to everyone. Have a great game. Yes, thank you so much for watching, guys. Keep winning.